Hello, and welcome to another Imaginers, starring me, Coffee Cheetah. I don't have a cup of coffee, because it's actually in the pot right now. That's the sound you're hearing. Uh, it's finishing up. But anyway, today I'm going to show you the answer to the mind reading trick from yesterday, or whenever the last time I put an episode up. I mean, the video. These aren't exactly episodes. But, um, anyway, uh, if you are a new viewer and or subscriber, uh, welcome to the show. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, to see how this, like, this trick being performed at normal pace, you can go to the video, uh, should be linked in the description, but maybe it won't be. Uh, should, actually, no, it will be in the recommended video right up there, or there somewhere. Uh, but from, uh, yesterday, or like I said, the last time I put it up. So, uh, if you aren't new, but just coming back, thanks for still staying with the show. But here's the solution. Uh, so... There's these four cards, which, like I said, I did not study. Now, I've done this enough, so I'm starting to get the hang of what's on what card. But, um, it's a fairly simple trick, actually. Oh, yeah, also, as you can tell, I'm in a different background today. Um, yeah. Refrigerator with letters. Okay, so, um, they have a spider... Star, let me get up close. This is what one of the one, one of the cards looks like. Another card. And another card. That's the last one actually. Uh here's the backs of them. Pretty much the same. Alright, so, uh, there's actually a secret code. Shh, it's a secret. Uh, to what this is. Alright, so, um, they have each, uh, pad, like each object has its own number. I'll go in order of the numbers. The, the, and their shapes have an easy way of remembering. Okay. Number one is um, the toothbrush. Looks like a one, if that's how you can remember it. How you remember number two is the headphones. And that you can remember one, two, two uh, earpieces or buds. Hey, up close! <laughs> Alright, three. Ah, uh, yes. Three is the flower because of the three flower heads. Four is the chair because of the four legs. Five is the star because of the five points. Star and the other one. Okay. Uh, six. Six, you would think, oh, it's the rope. It looks like a six. Nope. It's the apple because the apple also can look like a six if put the right way. Now, I, it's a mirror image right now, so it looks like the opposite of six to you. But, in person, it looks like a six. Anyway, seven. Seven is the golf club, because it, it kind of looks like a seven. And it's, again, everything's opposite on this. Um, because it's facing you guys. Uh, eight, spider. Eight legs. Nine. Nine is the rope because it looks like a nine. And ten is the clock because it's at ten o'clock. Low battery. This video might not end well. Alright, so that's a little bit complicated to remember until you do the trick a few times. Um, I could go back to the chair, but for now I'll be like this. Um, the talking head. <laughs> Comment if you get that. It, it, okay, I'll say it. it's a band. Talking heads. All right, so the person you tell a person to pick an object. Um, I need some sort of table. I guess I'll just put the chair. 
really close. Alright. So, let's say, alright, we're going to say they pick the, the spider, okay? So then they flip it over, and you see this. Alright, wait. They flip over the ones with the spider on it. Now that's not how you know how the trick is. Alright, this is how you know. Alright, so this one's the only one showing like this. These cards are like this. See the buttons on his shirt? Different amount. So, if, guess which item, they turn this card over. Guess which item it would be? The number, uh, guess the buttons on his shirt. It would be the chair because of the four right there. So let's say it's, we said it was eight. So it would be these ones turned over. 3 plus 1 equals 4. 4 plus 4 equals 8. So you would know. You act. Alright, so you look at the person, act like you're reading their mind. Say, I can read your mind. Maybe do like this, or hmm, there's some sort of thinking face. Like you're reading their mind. Count, uh, quickly count the number of the cards, and, or the number of the buttons, and voila, you have read their mind. Uh, so thank you for watching this video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe, um, and keep watching this channel for more. Or, oh, also follow me on Google+. Plus. Um, uh, you should easily be able to find my Google+. Plus. Well, I'm right up here, so I'm just going to turn it off. Alright, see you later, guys.